Hello guys, Chris B here and welcome back to another video in this one my friends I'm gonna be testing the GeForce GT 1030 GDDR5 in Forza Horizon 4 I'm running of course the latest Nvidia drivers at the time of recording this video which are 471.11 This one is the MSI Aero version of the GT 1030 so it comes already overclocked out of the box And we're running it with a Ryzen 9 5900X and 32 gigabytes of RAM because this is a GPU benchmark So yeah, we don't want to bottle naked but you should be fine with something like a, a fourth gen i5 like an eighth gen i3 that should be perfectly enough for uh, the gt1030 to achieve 99 percent of usage in this game so let's get right into it shall we and we're playing at 1080p resolution for now using the very low settings yep it's very low settings Okay, so is the 1030 good for Forza Horizon 4? I actually expected a little bit better here at very low settings. Not gonna lie, guys. Oh boy, okay, okay. Maybe outside... Oh gosh, okay. Yep, this is me driving cars, by the way, my friends. I I'm not like this in real life, I promise, okay? <laughs> anyway, we're gonna drive around these rows for just a little bit. Uh, see our FPS outside of races, then we're gonna get into a race, of course. Maybe we should also uh, keep on doing the campaign, you know, and the missions and stuff. Yeah, unfortunately, if you want a 60 FPS experience, well, 1080p is not gonna be the resolution of choice, obviously. Okay, start race event. Here we go, guys. Let's start counting our frames. Oh boy. It's very close, like, to 30, guys. I, I'm, I'm scared. Will it actually drop from 30 FPS? Probably not at this point, but I, yeah, I don't know. I really expected better coming from a GT 1030. Not sure why. Maybe because the 710, well, the 710s, not, we shouldn't compare things to the 710. Okay. <laughs> yeah, 31 FPS there, by the way. Not very good. So if you guys have seen my other Forza Horizon videos, you know that I completely suck at driving in this game and I'm actually doing all right today. Yeah, I'm not really crashing against the walls too much. Oh, uh, never mind. This is just hard to control, all right? I gotta get like a, a steering wheel. That, that would be amazing. So you guys can see how uh, bad I do drive actually in, in reality oh boy yeah I don't think we're gonna finish first in this one but at least we can see that the game doesn't really drop from 30 fps so if you are aiming for a 30 fps locked experience well you gotta play at 1080p low settings I'm gonna go ahead and test 900p here first still with the very low settings okay so this is it, 1600 by 900. Let's continue the race. And uh, it's still in the 30s. Oh my God, this is not very good. I think even at 720p, it won't be a very smooth experience, like a 60 FPS experience at least. And I was really looking forward to that. Well, at least it's not the GT 1030 DDR4, right? That would get like 20 frames per second <laughs> when we're getting like 40. So, yeah, if you have the DDR4, consider selling it fast and getting the GDDR5. Or maybe buy something else, even like a GTX 750, 650 Ti should be better uh, than the GT 1030 DDR4 version. Seventh place, that was awful, guys. 45 FPS on average there at 900p. I'm gonna restart this. Now, at 900p, I can actually... Um, feel the difference in smoothness, you know, we're just gonna play for a couple of more seconds here Maybe like 30 I don't know. I, let's let's go. Let's keep on playing. <laughs> okay. I'm third place now we're, we're doing better and crashing more, but it doesn't matter as long as we finish first or better than seventh uh, it's good, right? That's enough for 900p, guys. Let's drop it down to 720 to see if we can get closer to 60. I don't think so at this point. Even on very low settings, I, I totally didn't expect this. I expected to play this game on high at 1080p and get uh, like around 30 FPS on average, but it doesn't seem like it's the case here. So 720p, 42, still very similar to 900p slightly smoother i can see that i can feel it um but it's not 60 fps it's very close right now though it's now oh 
it wasn't that way. Okay. Gosh, damn it. I gotta look at the map as well. This is a problem with 32-inch monitors, guys. First place. Here we go. Get wrecked, boy. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, this is like the most intensive little spot in this particular race. Um, it drops down into like 41, maybe 40 FPS at 720p. It dropped down to like, what, 37, 36 at 900p and uh, 31 at 1080p. So there, there isn't really that big of a difference, but it's a noticeable one still um, because I can feel it. By the way, if you're wondering outside of races and these events, you're going to get higher frames per second. You're probably likely going to average around 60 at 720p, as you can see. Yep, not too bad. 70s even. Okay, this is... It's playable, definitely. Is it the best experience? Obviously not, but it's a GT 1030, so it's good that it plays the game at least. And it's playable at all the three resolutions that we tested so far. So that's something there going for our GT 1030. Not bad. What's bad is my car now, like, it's completely wrecked. I still want to test medium settings at the three resolutions, so we're gonna do that, first of all, at 720p. All right, we're back here. Things are looking kind of bad. I don't know, it might actually drop from 30, guys. 720p resolution using uh, medium settings, as you can see. Okay, let's go do the main mission and explore the world for a little bit here at medium. As you can see, it's still can achieve 60 which is quite impressive actually oh boy i'm fine it's all good <laughs> jesus christ this is so you know what you know what i'm stopping the fps counting system right now because i want to change the miles per hour to metric yes that's exactly what i want to do i am sick of the the miles per hour you know that's I, it sucks a little bit. I, yeah, I'm just not used to, okay? <laughs> Jesus, uh, okay, all right, it's all good, it's all good, guys. Can I achieve max speed now? The car was really inconsistent back there. Oh, boy, yeah, 240, 250 kilometers per hour. That's insane. And here's a right turn. Oh, boy. <laughs> it's not here, actually. I missed. <laughs> okay. Yeah, dropping into the 30s once again in this little town area. I'm actually playing against all of these guys. Well, that's not good, is it? <laughs> all right. Let's go. Let's crash their cars and stuff. Let's wreck them all. Yeah, boy. That's a beautiful drift. Never mind. Well, it actually was. I am impressed with that drift. <laughs> Can I actually... Get close to those guys. Oh my god, how did I not crash against the three? Uh, can I go through here? Oh no, that's a checkpoint. I, yeah, you saw nothing. Oh yeah, pro plays. Look at that. Even slowing down and stuff. Things that I don't really like to do in car games. Yeah, I hate slowing down for some reason. <laughs> yeah, I'm still first place. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I don't, no, 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 I'm trying to get in front of him. All right, I am definitely going to lose first place. How? How am I still here? Oh, we should test this out at 900p medium now. Of course, by the way, the other area, the other race was a little bit more intensive than this one. This is just in the countryside, I guess. Uh, okay. Oh, it looks a little bit better. Definitely. For sure. 30s now. Uh, but this area right here with the houses is also very intensive. We're almost there. We're going to finish first place. Are you serious? This has to be on easy, right? I mean, I can't. I am really bad at these games. And <laughs> I'm doing this all right. Okay. It's daytime. It's beautiful again. Very close to... 30 and dropping into the 20s this is not a good experience anymore guys avoid playing this one at medium settings oh my gosh yeah this is rough i did not expect this once again i i really thought this could do better we're gonna finish one more race in the middle of this one i'm gonna change it to 1080p so we're getting 30 right at the beginning 28 720p will definitely get 30 plus if we're dropping into the high 20s at 900 
So yeah, 720p 30 FPS at medium should still be a reasonable option if you want to play this game. But yeah, I, I wouldn't do 900p medium. It's just it's way too sluggish, you know. 20s, it's not good. Well, at least not everything is bad. The averages are all right. You could overclock your 1030 if you wanted to and get slightly more FPS and that would probably make the 1030 uh, be at 30 plus even at 900p medium settings. So that's something to consider there. Um, but yeah, let's try out the 1080p resolution now. Here we go, 1920 by 1080 medium. Yep, not good not good it's playable compared to something like a gt710 obviously but it is very rough guys i wouldn't do this okay i just remember there are some racing games like f1 2019 or 18 maybe in the ps3 that actually drop from 30 here and there so if you're running a controller or a steering wheel i'm not sure i've never tried a steering wheel by the way on a computer uh oh gosh it's so bad sometimes uh but yeah possibly it could feel a little bit better or feel a little bit smoother even with the lower fps i i don't know the controllers do that steering wheels i have no idea i would actually love to try a steering wheel in this game should be a lot of fun but i'm not gonna spend that money on the steering wheel i prefer to spend it on gpus to bring more content to you guys, you know? So Logitech, if you want to sponsor a video, hit me up. <laughs> it is reasonably playable. 30 FPS average there. I was indeed expecting slightly worse performance considering that we got 31 on average at 900p, I believe. Um, but well, that's it guys. Medium settings does look considerably better than very low, that's for sure, but if you want to play at 1080p, I'd stick to very low settings. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And if you actually liked it, you know, and want to watch more videos like this, I have an entire GT 1030 playlist down below in the description if you want to check that out as well. As always, love you all. Bye bye